Hi guys, Charlie and Beauty here. Today we're going to do a haul for you and I'm with Keely, my cousin. Um, we went to shops like, I went to MAC, Topshop, New Look, H&M and International and just stuff like that and Poundland. Um, but I'm also going to um, show you what I got yesterday. It arrived, oh, we went to WH Smith as well. Um, it arrived in the mail yesterday because I ordered a... What are you doing? Um, I ordered a tinted moisturiser off clickforbeauty.net and that's a really good website. You can get um, really good um, beauty items on there for cheaper than they usually would be or that haven't come out yet in the UK. So, um, shall I start off with that? So this is from clickforbeauty.net. It's the Stila SPF 30 um, oil-free sheer colour tinted moisturiser and I've got it in bare. And it's basically just a tinted moisturiser. Um, it's got a really good. It just makes your skin really like, um, like blurs your blemishes, sort of. So it they smoothens your face. Yeah, and like just complements your skin tone really it's well. Really good. So that was twenty two pounds. Um, I don't know how much it would be in England because it's not out in England yet. Um, but I know you can get it on the internet and that website. So, you wanna go? No, you can do all your stuff if you, them things if you want. Okay, um, we went to Mac. I oh, won't for that either. We went to, well, I went to Mac, and this is actually from Keely. Cause I'm lovely. Uh, for my birthday present, which my birthday was ages ago, but she lives in Spain, so. Um, I got the color, All That Glitters, which is this one here. AKA Keely. She decided to call it Keely. Because I got it for her. Yeah, so it's all that glitters. You won't be able to see that, but anyway. It's a really nice pearly, pinky, browny colour. It's pearl, kind of. Yeah, um, and it's really good for school. It's quite similar to um, Naked Lunch, but this one's a bit sort of shinier and glittery. Um, hence the name, all that glitters. But it's really nice and I'll wear it for school quite a lot. So, yeah. Um, that was £10 because I got it in pan form. I think it's a little bit more expensive if you get it in the actual eyeshadow form. So, yeah, that's what we got from MAC. Then I went to a... Um, boots? Was it Boots? Yeah. Boots. And this is also what um, Keely got me. Um, it's the colour tattoo um, in bronze on bronze. And it's a really nice shade. It's sort of like the MAC Paint Pots, but just a very much cheaper version. And it's waterproof. Just like that. It's not waterproof. Yes, it is. I thought you said that one was the waterproof one. No, it's not waterproof. You said before. You put it on your arm. Your, um... no, that was another thing that I tried on. Oh, okay. Anyway, yeah, it's supposed to stay on for 24 hours, but I don't think it does. It definitely stays on your hands, though. Yeah, um, it's but it's a really nice shade, and I really like that for school to just use as a base. Then I got um, from Miss Sporty um, this Mini Me lip liner in watermelon and it's just, I'm wearing it now um, under a lip gloss but it's just a really nice um, lip liner and quite a natural shade. Then I got some contact lenses eye drops because my, eye, eyes. my yeah. eye just like messed up from my contact lenses so I just got them. And then just a Nivea Soft Rose lip balm. Um, yeah, because my lips are chapped. Um, then we went to Poundland and got some crisps and stuff. And I got this Collection 2000 lip balm, um, lip gloss. It's actually really good. It smells really nice because sometimes yeah. you can get really dotty. And it's not there. that. She's put it on me and it's not that sticky. It's quite nice. Yeah, she hates lip gloss because she hates the stickiness of some of them. And that's actually not that bad. Yeah, and it smells nice and yeah. Oh, and if you're wondering, it's in the shade Adore, number six. But yeah, you can do something now. Well, the first shop, shop I went to is New Look. So I can find the bag. Here it is. And I bought this jump quite a thin jumper with like oh I'll show you what I've got for like you look as well stitchy thingies in it I know it's not most people's kind of style 
but it is for me. I quite like basic things. And this was, it was twenty two ninety nine, and then it's gone down to seventeen ninety nine, basically eighteen pounds. I forgot to say how much these are. And anyway, it's really good. I could really like it. This was about four pounds. This was one ninety nine. This was four ninety nine. Um, sure this was a pound, and this was a pound. So yeah. And basically, then they have. <laughs> You're not going to show them. They have this. I'm just gonna, this offer in new looks like. She got three pairs of knickers for seven pounds, and I got all them. That's basically it. They're really nice, folks. Um, as we're in the shop, new look. I also got new look school trousers. And um, these are like the Miss Sexy ones. They're like oh my god, look, fifteen percent off healthcare and boots. Okay, great. Um, they're like the Miss Sexies. They're like sort of the same material, like sort of stretchy material. Um, skinny bottoms, which I probably will get told off for. Stop writing that round. Sorry. I'll probably get told off for, but um, I really liked them. I've got a pair of safe trousers as well to wear them um, they just have a button there because you're not allowed loads of clasps and it's got two pockets at the front and two pockets at the back which I was really interested in to keep my phone in at school um, but yeah these were £15 and I just really like them they're well stripped I think yep so yeah you'll go <laughs> then I went to H&M which obviously I'm from Spain and H&M is usually quite basic clothes and in Spain it's not really good but the H&M out here is quite good. Even though it's quite good I only ended up getting one thing which is one of these fashionable skirts which are short at the front and then long at the back. It's quite frilly and what I like about you it... You talk, I'll hold it because it's right in front of your face. What the good thing is about it that underneath it has like a, a really thin fabric that it's a pencil skirt kind of so it doesn't it's not transparent or anything and um, I just really like it and it's good it doesn't obviously because you put it up quite high if you're a bit like not fat but like me shub stuff <laughs> it kind of like doesn't make in your bum goes really slim and stuff and I think tall people suit these more than short people because if you're short it just looks like you're wearing some weird thing honestly I don't know you can buy both more and that was 14.99 and also I really like that because you can dress it down or dress it up loads it's yeah, I've really tried dressy yeah things yeah shall I go now yep um I'll just do this really crap thing I needed one of these to replace an old one from Dory H Smith so it's really it's really boring oh, sorry I can't talk when you're rattling stuff um it's really boring it's like one pound um it's just a fold up with hole punch because I found loads of folders that have like little clips that you put in but I have too many papers to go in this one folder so I needed one that had like hole punched things so I could secure it properly so that was like one pound four pence something should I do another one yeah okay um then I went to Topshop and I bought this really really nice bag that I've been eyeing on the internet um, it's just for school. It's a um, what is this? Not it's not leather. It's not real leather. It's like four leather. Even though it quite looks heavy, it's like it looks good. Quality. You look at it and you think that if you try to rip it, you won't be able to. It looks quite. It's really good. Um, it was quite pricey for a school bag, but I'm sure it will last me a long time. It has good pocket there for my phone. Oh. Um, then inside it has a lot of space inside um, to fit all my school stuff in it. Um, a pocket there and two pockets, um, just the standard pockets in your bag. Um, I really like it. It was £36, which to some of you that won't be too expensive, but for me it was quite expensive for a school bag. Oops. Smells a bit of pepper. Um, but yeah, it has two handles, or you can use it as a shoulder bag. I'll probably more use it as a shoulder bag, um, but or just carry it like that. But um, yeah, I really like this bag, and I think it was a good expenditure. 
Yeah. What? Like a good, yeah, I know what a you good mean. spent. Money well spent. You'll go. Um, then in boots, um, as Charlie kind of said, like £36 might not seem a lot to some of you. Same as like, what, how much is the naked palette? 32 the naked palette is £32. £32, pounds and I, exact, I haven't got a £32, so I kind of went for the MUA cheaper version. Makeup Academy Professional, I don't know what's the name of it. Eyeshadow palette, Heaven and Earth. Yeah, they didn't have the undress they palette, which, which, I know I is the, which I know is the exact dupe for there. the naked palette, but this is basically the The same. only difference is this hasn't got a shade of grey or black. That's basically it. So there we are. And that was £4. Which is pretty good, I think, and I've just got to get used to it. Yeah, because they finally bring out the pro range of MUA in our um, local town drugstore. Milton Keynes. Super drug, I mean, um, in Milton Keynes. So I was really happy that they bring out the pro version because I've been waiting for them to bring it out for ages and ages and ages, and they finally did. And they've run out already of the undress palette, which I was going to buy as well. What I like about these is it, it says here, perfect natural look. Mine will be perfect, but it's definitely natural. So that's good. Um, yeah, and they're really pigmented and really good for the price, so... Is that it? Oh no, is that yours? Yeah, I went to International, and I went there like a week ago, and I saw this, like, coat thing, not many people I don't think would like, and it was £30, and I went back then, it's actually it was back in sale. For they're seven... not going to you, know. Cause it... Okay, it was actually on sale today for £17, which I was over the moon with, and I don't regret getting it, and it's... There it is, it's, I'm going to stand up to show you this. There it is, it's just like a kind of an army thingy, I don't know, an army, but... It's a really nice, Yeah, like, I really like it. Like khaki, a khaki, um, brown mac jacket, sort of like a Ray Mac, it's really nice. I'll just bend down one sec, just tie that like that. Oh my god, this has gone on for 12 minutes. This is really nice. I think there we go. Yeah, that, that's... That's it, that was £17, used to be £30. That's good bargain. Anyway, that was our haul, guys. Oh yeah, and I got some super glue. Which I bought because I made it and she couldn't because they thought she might snip it. <laughs> yeah, Poundland are really gay, they don't let you buy like scissors and glue. Yeah. If you're like under 18, it's really weird. Anyway, that was our haul, hope you enjoyed. Bye! Bye.